What's up guys, Spin Firearms here. And last night I traveled out of state for a family wedding. And of course I brought my firearms, as all should you. Now, I took a poll and honestly was very shocked by it. Once again, literally these polls are eye-opening for me and make me realize how much we need to work on learning our laws, learning our rights, and learning how to do things properly. Therefore, you never have to worry about traveling with a fire. Out of 4,200 votes, 61% said, yes, I travel with my firearm everywhere I go. Those are the people that know their laws. Those are the people that realize if you go state to state, laws change, but you can simply avoid that by taking your firearm, unloading it, putting it in a safe for this state, pulling it right back out, putting it in your holster for the next state, all based off the laws. And there are great tools like USCCA that will explain all that and break it down to you perfectly. 29% was sometimes. Now, what I would say to the people who do it sometimes is I get it some states are a pain to travel with like when i went to hawaii i wanted to carry so bad but you know i gotta respect the law so i left it in my hotel but i had it with me at the hotel it is what it is and then 10 percent was never and i think these are mostly just trolls i think it's people just messing with the polls because i had a couple other polls where there's a certain percentage of people that just it just doesn't doesn't make sense uh usually people with firearms want to carry and they want their firearm with them. <clears throat> so I would chalk up 5% of that to being trolls and the other 5% of people who are getting just getting into this, new to it and still want to learn. So I'm going to try and help you guys learn in some videos to come. Now the next poll I took, 6,700 votes and that was how you carry. This one was somewhat shocking and I'll explain why. So open carry was 10%. I could have guessed that. There's some states open carry friendly like the state I live in. You can open carry. I just don't choose to do it. Then outside the waistband, but concealed, 9%. I could have guessed that because if you're gonna have it concealed underneath something, might as well have it inside the waistband. Then inside the waistband was 67%, which made 100% sense to me. But this is the shocker, 14% pocket carry the most. Out of any other way they carry, pocket carry 14%. And I feel like I honestly have played a little role in this because I always talk about the importance of pocket carry. It does have its role in everyday carry. And I think it's a great way to do things, especially for a backup. Now, even though it was shocking, I think it's cool that 14% of you pocket carry. And I think more people need to dive into that lane as it's maximum concealability. It's a last ditch effort. It's a get off me gun, stuff like that. But those are the most recent poll results. Thanks for uh, being a part of them. And thanks for watching.